Hey you gamers out there, welcome back to another video. Hey Slippin' Squad, welcome to this video. How do you become a Slippin' Squad? Click that notification bell. If you wanna be just a gamer squad, you don't have to click the bell, you can just subscribe. That would be the world to me. I have this 10 year old camera right here. It is not that great. I'm probably gonna try it in one of my videos. Hopefully I can get a better lens. Hopefully it can be better quality and maybe I might just get another camera. But what I'm using is an iPhone 5, so just bear with me. The only, vi like the only times I get views is whenever I'm doing a how-to video. Like I, it takes me four hours just to edit a Fortnite video or a Minecraft video. It takes me like six hours or so just to edit it. I only get a couple of views. So today I'm going to be remaking a video, my most popular video, and it is called how to make a racer putty or it's called how to make so, uh, yeah, something I, f I forget since that is the only video that i actually get views on hopefully this recovers my channel because lately my videos have not been going on anybody's suggested box and i just lost a subscriber that will not stop me losing a subscriber hurts me but anyways let's get on to it all right so as you guys can see this is my kneaded eraser it is a pretty basic kneaded eraser now it's the ones you guys buy at the store if you guys look into it you guys will see that it is really big this is without zooming out as you guys can see this is the size of the paper and that's that if i was to zoom in it would be way bigger now all you need for this is a piece of paper and an eraser. I have the um, Saddler's eraser. I don't know exactly what it's called, but whatever eraser you guys can find, just use it. This is the one that I'm using. So yeah, if you guys want the brand, it'll pop up right there. So basically what you need to do is just keep on rubbing it onto your paper until you get little shavings. As you guys erase, you guys will get little tiny shavings. Now with this eraser that I am using right now, sometimes it makes a really big piece. So if you guys can see right there, that's a little tiny chunk right there. That's a little tiny chunk right there and also right there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it off of my paper so you guys can see it more better because this is like a round table. So if you look at it, I can't even zoom in. I'm just gonna zoom in inside of the edit. As you guys can see, those little pieces right there are the shavings. Now you're gonna make multiple of these, then you're gonna crumble them together. Now some people do not know how to crumble them together because sometimes whenever you're starting, it was really hard. Same with me, whenever I started, it was really hard for me just to crumble them together. A really easy way is to just grab them all and then just squish them. The best way is to grab, put them in a little pile then just rub them on your piece of paper until it becomes like a long piece of every single thing of them. And then if you keep doing this, you'll finally get a little tiny piece. And you can actually squish it by this point. It'll be easier to squish and you can just squish it. I usually like to do it in this motion. And this is called kneading. Kneading is when you take a shape, you squish it, and it becomes a different shape. But in this case, what we're doing with this little tiny piece is we are kneading it to make it more softer and better in our hand because it it's really hard to squish whenever you have it for the first five seconds. So that is basically how you make it. I'm gonna make a tiny bit more. Hopefully you get a big piece. You also have to hold the paper whenever you're doing this because the paper would move around if you guys look. See? But as you do this gradually, your kneaded eraser will get bigger. That's how you make it. It's really simple if you guys know how to make it. Anyways, uh, please make sure you guys smash the like button. That would be the best thing that you guys can do because my channel is dying gradually every day. And I don't know if I can continue YouTube without you guys subscribing and leaving a like. 170 subs with only like two views that mind blows me it hurts whenever you guys don't subscribe if you guys do not enjoy my channel you guys can easily leave a dislike leave a dislike if you guys do not enjoy this video i want to see how many people this helps versus how many people hate me all right if you hate me leave a dislike if you like me subscribe and like the video and if this worked for you please leave a like and subscribe all right peace boys <laughs> Oh, <laughs>